Southern Texas today, we love supporting local businesses. Yeah, you'll remember it started during the pandemic when so many stores and restaurants were being forced to close their doors. Now that things are getting better, we still want to highlight the places that would love to see you walk through their doors. This morning, our own Barry Roy brings us the story of Three West Ale House. This might sound like lunch, but it tastes like a rebound. One of the long weekends uh, in May, we decided we're all going to come in. We did, and we started cleaning. And of course, you know, one thing leads to another. We had a small fire. Well, the fire one was small and extinguished small. quickly with little damage. Vera Chudesma says that coupled with the struggle to find workers, she decided a rebrand of her favorite place was in order. <laughs> You shut down with uh, a completely running business. You know, one day on Sunday we have dinner service and Monday we shut down. Um, so it was kind of a heart-wrenching decision to, because, you know, once you shut down, you don't know what other obstacle that's going to come that you may not even open again. Shudesma says she understood the risks, but says it was a calculated one given the restaurant climate. This place needed a new facelift and new menu. And believe me or not, food trend changes every two to three years. In a facelift, it's gotten gone on the chalkboard's new seating and lighting added. And a brand new menu filled with foods inspired from across the globe. People have said, if ain't broken, don't fix it. You took my favorite chips and queso away. I'm not coming back. Vera or, says she's read all the uh, comments. She, she gets that change is hard for some, but hopes under the direction of a new flame, a new day is dawn because. If we don't keep up with it, we become an absolute. And I don't want to be the restauranteur or a chef that has the same thing on the menu. Uh, and just, you know, because that's what's comfortable. In Temple, Barry Roy, Six News. Now, if you're a business owner or know someone who would like to be featured, let us know. You can email Texas today at kcentv.com or you can text us 254-777-6000. If that doesn't make you hungry, I don't know what will, Chris. Look delicious.